I'm Nate, this is Chiefers Productions, and today we've got something a little bit different. Um, we're off to a local gun shop. It's called the Eastern Gun Company. Um, that's a bit of a, a little jewel, really, of a shop. Um, it's quite small, but he's always got loads of stuff in there. Uh, I've got a friend with me who's behind the camera. Dad's in there today, he can't make it, so the guy behind the camera want to buy a gun. Uh, he's a a novice he's got one gun he didn't really use so we're going to take him in there he's looking to buy a pistol uh, and this little shop is in a place called brundle just outside norwich um that's, that's a little gem of a shop what i like about it is he's always got used stuff uh, in good condition and at a good price um he's sell online as well but as you know you can you can't get stuff delivered uh, and for those who are beginning uh, new to shooting, if you are going to visit a gun shop, make sure you take ID. That's, that's the law that they got to ID it before they sell it to you. So uh, we're now going to pull up at the shop in a little while and um, take the guy in behind the camera. We'll swap places and then uh, we'll see what they got and we'll see what you end up buying. And um, if he does buy something, we've got to take it back to the range and have a good old blast up. So uh, if you're interested, keep watching. pulling up at the Eastern Gun Company. They've got a little bit over the front here where you can park. Uh, they also got a car park around the back. And uh, so uh, let's get in there and uh, see what happens. Right, here we are. Nice cozy little shop. So uh, we've now got to swap places. I'm going to take the camera and my buddy here is uh, we're going to hand him over to the guy in the shop. The guy in the shop didn't want to be on camera, which is fair enough. We've got no association with the shop at all. I just asked his permission to shoot here. Uh, I'm just going to take the camera, give you a quick look around, show you all the goodies they got, and uh, we'll take it from there. Right, so here we are. This is uh, this is the air gun section. Uh, a lot of nice stuff on the wall there. Drooling material in the rack down the bottom here. These are all used guns. Very good condition, good prices. Oh, that's nice. Lovely jobly. Uh, more guns over here. The light is a bit, is a bit dim here. So uh, lots of lovely stuff. These, uh, this is the shotgun section. We can't buy them, so we'll skip past them. Loads of accessories, targets, you name it. He's got everything here. Right, let's have a look at that. Play your pallets. Play ammo. So this is a bit of a jewel in the crown of a shop. I love coming here. Always oh, got good gear. I think the guy's pretty busy at the minute. What we got under here? Oh, lovely jobby. Right, lots of nice stuff. So what I'm going to do? Um, all shotguns. These are these are all firearms stuff. Um, anything with padlock is a firearms. You can't you can't okay. buy that. Obviously, they're, they're all sort of licensed stuff. And um, yeah, that's what they call a PCP. So this is a that's an air bottle which you fill up with a diving bottle or a hand pump. But a hand pump is pretty hard going, uh, and you get however many shots, shots, thirty, forty. You still have them on my paintball gun. Yes, that's, that's a similar thing. Yeah, See that? yeah. I had that's that's powerful. They're quite powerful. Yeah, we did part. Yeah. We've done a video where we power tested one, mm -hmm. and that was quite that. That's thing. Well, you know, they, they sting you. Yeah, 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 I know. So what we got in here? This. Uh, no, you won't, mate. No, you won't. Right, nice little selection of knives. I like these revolvers. I think I'm going to get one one day. Yeah, I thought that one looks nice. Just naughty. Yeah, nice. that's lovely, isn't it? Yeah, old school. Oh, that's a good price on that. What's a 177 as well? Oh, I wish I hadn't seen that. <laughs> I, I, can't really, I can't really afford another gun at the minute. I wish I hadn't seen that. That's the trouble coming in a gun shop, mate. That's, uh... Right, okay. Uh, I'm going to turn the camera off. Uh, the gun shop don't want to be in camera. I'm going to hand my body over to him and uh, see what he end up with. And we'll show you what he's bought after. Right, we're back from the gun shop. Um, Gaz has bought himself a nice Glock. Was that a Glock 17, Gaz? Yeah. Uh, Glock 17. Um, we sh we'll get guys to show you that on camera in a minute. That's a, how many sh how many rounds does it make? 21. 21 shot mag. That's like the rotary mag. Uh, I think um, six came out with that to start with. Um, anyway, it's got 21 round rotary mag. He's a newcomer to shooting, so I'm just going to show him how to put the gas in. Uh, we're going to give it a dab with the old silicone grease, and um, we're going to have a look at it and um, have a blast up. So. Uh, Switch places and um, you can show the gun on camera, Daz, Gaz. 
Daz isn't here today. Gaz and Daz, I keep getting mixed up. So Gaz is now going to show you on camera what he's bought and um, then we'll put the gas in and have a blast up. Here we have it. Right, I'll just zoom in on that. Right, so that is a Glock 17, is it Gaz? Yep. Right, nice. And um, show us the mag. So that's the mag with the rotary type loading system. That's like the belt, a belt feed system. Uh, me and Daz, nine robbers have got one of these types. Um, love the gun, um, good price, a guy in the shop was really helpful. So I'm just going to show get, uh, Gaz how to put the gas in. We'll give it a little dab with the old silicone and um, we'll see what happens. Okay Gaz, so if you get your gas mate, um, you can put, you can put your gun down. Right. And, um, this that's, the that's, part of, that's part of the safety, so basically if you drop if you drop the gun or something, that trigger ain't going to go off by itself, so that's that's basically part of safety. Uh, I think it's got, has it got manual safety as well? Did you? On the bottom there, mate. Right, so that's in shoot at the minute, that's safe. What you're okay. safe, that is shoot. Alright, right. so yeah. I'll put it on safe, and then when you're ready to go, so it's like a double safety really. Locks. That yeah. locks the trigger. So yeah. you don't need that bit at the minute. So if you get your gas tank, if you keep this tank, now you want just give that a real, just a real little tiny dab on the edge of that sponge. Yeah, that's it, that's enough. That's all you need. Right. You want to get your Allen key. And I'd suggest So slide that back. Allen key in there. Undo that until your gas will drop in nice and easy by itself. Feed the nose oh. in. Feed the, feed the nose in. So that's it, like that. Yeah. Okay, so wind that down until you feel it touch. And then you want to try and do that in one motion, yeah? Mm -hmm. If you hear it hiss, don't worry, just keep tightening it until your hair stops hissing. Don't overdo it, but just do it until it stops so hissing. Stop. So hold that firmly, get hold of that, and, and give, it a, give it a twist. Try and do it in one motion. Sometimes you can't hear them. It's, it's a new gun, you might not. Is that, is that tight? Enough? Is it tight? Tight enough, I yeah. think. Alright mate, let's have a feel. I mean, that's a new gun. So not like I'll, I'll show you, yeah? Yeah, yeah that's enough. So, so I'm, I'm, not, I'm not overdoing it, but that's, that's a fair enough. So you can't do it, just pressure, it yeah. right. Slide that back down. Uh, you put that back in your gun now and you're ready to go. <laughs> Even though the safety's on and yeah. uh, all the rest. Still so, um, so what I'll do now, I'll get behind the camera, get you shooting, and um, we'll show it with a blowback and everything. And uh, yeah, and I'm gonna zoom in on the gun in operation. And then sometimes what we do is um, do a bit of slow mo, showing the yeah. Sometimes we do a bit of slow mo, showing the, the slide going backs and forwards. So take it away, mate. Just start blasting. Your first shot, you might see a puff of gas, but don't worry. I didn't get no pump. Huh? Well, oh, there we go. All right, it's a bit more. I have to give it a little bit more than the other one. Yeah, I see what you mean with your one now with the light trigger. Yeah. Yeah, because what you're doing, you're indexing the pellets around as well as you pull the trigger. Mm -hmm. That's to do with gun laws. They're not allowed to automatically load and stuff so that's all to do with the sort of regulations how they operate really I might hit it <laughs> what are you aiming for <laughs> the middle one where you um hit oh it. right yeah yeah i think i might yeah, hit it keep going mate it's like, take a bit of getting used to the distance and the sights and all the rest Whoa, you hit that bottom one, were you aiming for that? <laughs> you had it, that's a bullseye on the bottom one. <laughs> no, so, I'm, so I need to, what I'm, where I'm aiming, I need to come up a bit, I guess. Well, the idea is to, um, on, on your dots, you, you get the, 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 the target sitting on the top of your end one. Right. Some people put it on it, so you can't see it. You're uh -huh. supposed to have your target sitting on top of it. And on you top. just adjust the back ones up and down until, you, until you're comfortable until you and sort of find right. your way, really. Uh -huh. And again, that, that vary with the distance. This isn't the longest sort of range, really. I put pistol though, it's about right, I'd have said. Sort of yeah. 10 yards. Um, Could be good if I was aiming for that little one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah.
Yeah, you're getting there, mate. I can see you. I can see you hitting. Just, you just going to the right slope. Oh, that was near the bit, near the middle. Lovely, Charlie. I think you're out. It. I think you're out. Right, we're just going to give this a croony test, we're going to do three shots, a uh, second between each shot and then we'll get an average foot poundage. So, um Is that the average? No, there we go, there's the average, 1.69, so 1.7 foot pound gas. Nice. Sorry, so, uh, yeah, for that, for, that, for that sort of gun mate, that's about right. Right, guys, what's uh, what do you think of your new uh, Glock 17 then? Yeah, I love it. So Pleased with it, yeah? Yeah, awesome. Right, well, welcome to the shooting club. As you'll find, it's quite addictive. Uh, next time we see you, you'll probably have a few more. So, uh, thanks for watching, and uh, see you on the next video.